tracking that forecast. I'm First Alert 25 meteorologist Jordan Evans and another beautiful day as expected across central Texas as high pressure continues to dominate. But as it positioned itself a little bit farther to the north by the weekend, we start to get the southeast flow back and we'll get the humidity back in our forecast. But in the meantime, expecting a really nice couple of days here across central Texas and some cool starts to the morning. In fact, Waco has just now dropped down to 56 degrees. This is about two degrees warmer than our record low for today, so we'll have to continue to see if that drops and maybe ties that. 63 for Temple, or 60 in Temple, 64 for Bryan College Station, and 59 in Lamb Passes. Dew points in the 40s and 50s once again. This will help make it feel much better this outside this afternoon. Radar is pretty quiet, and we'll keep it quiet for all of us today. A couple air quality alerts that we talked about earlier in Dallas and Houston. Uh, if you have sensitive respiratory conditions such as asthma or COPD, and if you're traveling to one of these cities today, you may want to limit your time outside as you may have difficulty breathing. But air quality is not that big of a concern for Central Texas this afternoon. We're going to be tracking the lower dew points, which is going to again make it feel much nicer outside. And temperatures in the low 90s once again, 91 degrees for high today between 4 and 6 p.m. 94 uh, Marlin, 91 for Temple, 91 in Bryan College Station, a couple upper 80s out to our east along Interstate 45. And the feels like temperatures across central Texas all going to be in the mid to upper 80s, so feeling a little bit cooler than what it will actually appear on your thermometer later this afternoon. So definitely get outside and enjoy the nice weather. The 10 day forecast, we start to warm things up slightly, but for your Friday, we're still holding on to 92 degrees and humidity stays low through the rest of the work week too. 63 for your or 93 for your Saturday, plenty of sunshine through the weekend. UV index level is going to stay in the extreme category as well. So make sure you have plenty of sunscreen on if you plan to be outside. Then by next week, here comes the humidity as the winds change out of the south. We'll get the clouds back on Tuesday into Wednesday. And then as you can see, upper 90s may be starting to take shape later next week. But again, storm chances, they will stay out of this forecast for the next 10 days. You know,